how do I know if I am being punished or I'm being tested? This is a question that so many people ask. Uh, many people, when they go through difficulty in life, their, 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 their biggest concern is, is God angry with me? Uh, am I being punished? Did I do something wrong? Or is this just a test? And this is a question where, uh, you know, some people start to doubt. Some people start to, to become very, very scared that, Wait, wait, am I going through this difficulty because I did uh, something to anger Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? Well, the answer to this question is actually quite simple. And that is that we can determine the answer of am I being tested or am I being punished by looking at our response. So if our response to that um, difficulty, say, if our response is that we became closer to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, that we, that we purified ourselves, that we strengthened our faith, uh, that we did more towards Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, then in fact that difficulty is not a punishment, but rather it is a test. And moreover, in fact, it's a blessing because even though it's something that we're struggling with, it is purifying us. It's bringing us closer to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And in other words, it's bringing us closer to success. And so therefore, or even though on the surface it appears to be something bad, but in fact it is actually something good for us because it is bringing us closer to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. If on the other hand, whatever it is that we're experiencing of difficulty is taking us away from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, and moreover any experience, whether it is prosperity um, or difficulty, if it takes us away from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, then in fact that is not good for us. And in fact, that may be a sign that we have to change internally. Uh, rather, it is a sign that perhaps there's something within us that needs to be purified. So again, how do I know that am I being tested or am I being punished? The answer is by how you respond. If you get closer to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, then you know that that's actually a blessing uh, that you have passed the test. Uh, but if it takes you away from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, then you know that that's actually an indication that you, you need to change something internally. Now, how do we cope? Uh, the question of coping uh, it, throughout life, we are going to go through these trials. Um, what I'm going to talk about, uh, among other topics in this class, Transformed, I cover coping mechanisms. I cover um, how it is to heal. Uh, how can we heal? How can we deal with the, the, the struggles that we face in life? Not being able to deal with these things properly is it, it actually uh, keeps us from being able to, to, to get to our destination. We have to be a people of resilience. Um, as you know, life is a marathon, not a sprint. We have to be able to get through hurdles in order to be successful uh, in, in our return to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So my name is Yasmin Mujahid. I'm teaching this class Transformed online. It is no longer available on site. This is the only opportunity to take this class. It covers... Uh, generally uh, principles of spiritual development. Uh, and I, I urge you to sign up before the closing date. Again, this is the only opportunity to take this class. And it's something that's extremely relevant. It's something that I've, I've found has helped thousands of people all over the world. The, the topics that we cover here are, are something that we deal with every single day of our life. So I encourage you to sign up before it's too late.